What's going on YouTube? Brad here with Days of Dirt. It's Friday morning. We're down here in the shop. Gonna try to get a little work done to the, today. Uh, as you can see, the, the shop floor seemed to have dried up, so the humidity has kind of left us. It's a little chilly this morning, but hey, I'm, I'm good with that. I'll take that any day, so. I've already been down here for about an hour or so and already gotten started. Uh, had to put the camera on charge. Forgot to charge it last night, so I've been charging it while I've tried to get a little, get started a little bit here. Had a guy message me uh, about the tires yesterday, so I'm trying to work on getting all those broke down and getting them uh, piled up into an inventory. That way I can let him know what all I got and what all we're gonna get rid of. So if you don't see them come up, I know I said I was gonna post them on Facebook for sale. So if you, you know, if you're watching for them and you don't see them on Facebook, then that's why I'm gonna give him the first option since he was the first one to message me. Uh, what he don't buy, then I'll post on Facebook after that. But so right now I'm just working on getting all those uh, broke down and getting them stacked up here. That way we can see what all we got and what all we're gonna get rid of. Uh, once once I get done with that, that's, that's when I'm gonna jump over there and start trying to tackle that rear end. I'm quit talking about it. I've been talking about it all week, so I need to get to it. But anyways, uh, just wanna say thank you for watching. If you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button right down there. Ring the bell. Make sure you get future notifications. Always be sure to comment share with us your opinions i appreciate all the opinions on the uh concrete floor the other day um also if you haven't already make sure you check out our racing our website bradburyracing.com also bradbury racing 27 on facebook uh just hang out with me we're gonna try to get these tires broke down and see what we can get done after that I want to take just a second and say, uh, give a shout out to Mr. Wayne Smith. He has uh, generously contributed to Bradbury Racing and Days of Dirt for the 2021 season. He is a active follower and viewer of our channel here on YouTube as well as Facebook. So you guys drop a comment down there and make sure you thank Mr. Wayne for supporting us as well. and. Uh, from myself and Dallas, Mr. Wayne, we, we really appreciate that. That uh, means a lot to us. So, thank you.
<clears throat> Getting there. Christopher's out here again. I know you guys have missed him. Look at him working, boot and all. Look at it. I'm back. <laughs> Look at it. We'll see how good he gets around in a few. <laughs> I'm limited to what I can do. <clears throat> he hobbles along. Working on getting the calipers and everything off so we can pull this thing out of here. Brad's laying yeah. here. What? Come in on, sir, thank you. getting a little bit chilly here in Alabama. I don't know how it is where you guys are. I know we had somebody comment on our racing page the other week and I think he's from Canada and he said it was extremely cold already there. Thankfully it's been in the 60s and 70s so it's not extremely cold now, but it's getting chilly. Especially at night. Sounds like Chris is breaking stuff over there. I guess so. You guess so? Mm-hmm. Are you taking camera tomorrow? That's your job. That's your job. You did a video the other night. Can you? You can do videos now. You said it wasn't no good. I did not say that. No, well, no, I did. No, but in his videos, he's like this. Like, you can see everything. He's real close. I'm like, back the camera away. Just a little bit. Well, I'm gonna be personable. This is how he is right here. Got any boogers? <laughs> <laughs> you already getting hot? Yeah. I'm actually working. Oh, well, I can't work. I have a reason. Brad's moving a little slow because he just got done eating. What do you have for supper, Brad? Huh? What do you have for supper? Ramen noodles. No, you didn't. What do you really have for supper? Blimey. Tell them a little secret about you. Bologna sandwich. Bologna sandwich. <laughs> no, I have no blo <laughs> Brad's a really, really, really good cook. Really good cook. I think I've said that in one of our videos before. He cooks 90% of our meals. He did some fried taters and some smoked chicken, and I did some fresh green beans in the crock pot, but that's the only thing I did. He cooked everything else, and it was really good. Well, I don't know about smoked chicken because I don't eat chicken on a bone, but he ate too, so he said it was good. Was it good, Christopher? You ate some. What'd you say? What? You didn't eat chicken on a I don't eat chicken on I don't eat meat on a bone. Chicken on a bone. I'll eat a lot of stuff on the bone now. I just won't eat chicken on a bone. Oh, my. When we first met, I wouldn't eat anything on a bone, would I? I still don't like a lot of it. It was all on the bone at one time. Yeah, but it wasn't cooked on the bone. When it's cooked on the bone, it tastes bloody. I it don't taste very good. I could take the bones out of it and still wouldn't eat it. Before I cooked it. No. You, yeah. yeah, because it's not the same. If you say so. Chris for over here was eating his, and he said his was a little spicy. Brad loaded up with Creole, and he just can't handle the heat. It was good. <laughs> but I thought you cooked that time. Yeah, right. You know better. I don't do no smoking. God. I didn't cook nothing but the green beans. I put them on before I left for work this morning. You know, some people have to work these days, Christopher. You ain't worked for about six, eight weeks. I'll be going back. Are you so excited about it? I'm so excited. <laughs> Whoa, so it's getting serious. Mm -hmm. 
Brad said the other night too, we are, we will be at Magnolia tomorrow. He said he thought we were going. We will be at Magnolia Motor Speedway tomorrow watching. We're not gonna be racing. We just wanted to go watch some racing for a change. We don't go to very many races and watch. If we do watch it's on Flow Racing or Dirt on Dirt. So we're gonna go watch tomorrow. I've got a test in the morning um, to get certified at a job. We've gotta be there at eight o'clock in Birmingham, so we've gotta leave the house about 6.15. So it's gonna be a rather long day tomorrow. We'll see how well both of us hold up. See if we can make it back home without getting a hotel. Put it in there, shouldn't you know? My God. I need me some stickers on my boot. Where are you gonna put a sticker? Right there. And hey, right there. I need a 27 right there with flame shooting off of it. Well, hopefully you won't be in it for next racing season. Aren't you supposed to come out of it soon? Handicap crew. <laughs> but you'll be not handicapped long before I will. I guess that's why we got jacks, I guess, huh? Huh? I guess that's why we got jacks. Jacks. Oh, I was like, what are you talking about? Two of them now. Bolt. Oh, he's been working on this bolt now for five minutes. Right here. Oh man, that thing would spin right out. Uh oh, Chris is moving up. He didn't got went and got chair being so fast. Take the fifth off. No. Took that off the track when the bolt broke. Yeah, it come off the track. It's already halfway off anyway. You trying to take one bolt out of it. We gotta get our shocks to TJ. At TA suspension too, that's one thing we gotta do in the off season. Just have him check it and check them and go through them. Make sure everything looks good. TJ's been a huge, huge help this year. How many other Chris Grinch? Big little small. Um, he may we be out and my field without his help. What? He's definitely hey, don't no, just the one hanging up. Been a huge guidance. guys it looks like we're wrapping it up for the night he's got everything undone All here right. but he's still letting it it's still draining fluid so he's just gonna leave it like that for this weekend let all that drain we appreciate you guys liking be sure to like subscribe comment let us know what you think let us know what you'd like to see this off season um brad and chris you can kind of hear them and talk in the background they're talking about an addition to the shop so we're out growing this one. But thank you guys for watching. <laughs>